A lot has been said about that all-time mystery called energy. And here, just outside of Paris in the Free State, students had a good introduction into how energy affects our surroundings, with a particular emphasis on its relation to the martial arts. By doing these basic exercises, students can stimulate certain chakras within the human body to awaken healing energies. How does energy influence martial arts? Most martial arts have got an energy background. Your karate will have kata. Tang Sado has forms, Taekwondo patterns, Tai Chi, beautiful flowing movements. The energies, since these, these forms were created, has changed. Mainly due to man-made energies, electromagnetic fields. We've got satellite television, we've got mobile phones, we've got mains cables everywhere. And so the movements need to be adjusted slightly. And a, an easy example is a basic first kata in karate. Instead of going to the left, you start and go to the right and do kind of a mirror, mirror image. And you'll find you've got more energy. You can strength test it and there'll be a difference. A practical example of this was how to find positive and negative meridians by using a dousing rod. Various positive and negative energy lines surround us. If one can tune into these energies by applying your mind, then the results are tangible. There seems to be a lot of superstition out there regarding things that we cannot touch or see. Is this really the case? I think if a person does not uh, believe in energy, or, or that, as you say, a lot of people think it might be mumbo jumbo, it would be wonderful for them to come to a seminar and actually experience it. And when you actually feel how someone can take your energy away from you, drain it, and improve your energy and strengthen you. If you feel sick, do something to you using energy that really improves you immediately, you become a believer that these things exist. Secondly, I think that in our country many a times um, we got a religious aspect that people are very scared of getting involved in energy and I want to state this emphatically that this has got nothing to do with religion. It is energy that is available to every single one of us and it's God created energy. It's just people are sometimes write off what they don't understand. So I would suggest go to your instructor in this country, there are many of them that do do energy work and go and talk to them and actually go and get involved. And before people judge, I would suggest first practically go and try it and then make up their mind about it. Hey, you just get a fight.